Hey everyone, Tom Wainick here, marketingbeyondadvertising.com, and this is your Monday morning marketing quote. Today we're going to continue our discussion on how to position yourself in the marketplace and talk about choosing who to lose. So let's hear from Michael Treacy and Fred Wiersema in their book, Discipline of Market Leaders. Now the authors say that courage in the face of doubt is essential because selecting a value discipline is not just a choice about what to do, it's a choice about what not to do about what and who to leave behind on the journey toward market leadership. Now this is critical because positioning is all about making a series of trade-offs. Uh, one of the worst decisions you can make as a marketer is straddling two or more positions in the marketplace. By doing so, you do nothing but dilute your marketing message. Now there are a couple companies that come to mind that do a terrific job at choosing who or what to lose. The first is Scion. Now we've talked about Scion recently. Scion is the car company started by Toyota um, to market to the younger car buyers, ages 18 to 24. But Scion doesn't want to attract just any young car buyer. No, their goal is to attract the oft ignored outsider. Um, and the way that they do that is by alienating mainstream car buyers with this offbeat styling that they've come up with. Uh, so they really go out of their way to remain unpopular. Another company that does a terrific job at choosing who to lose is Geppetto's Workshop, a toy store in Mornington, Australia. And the way that they choose who to lose and what they stand against is uh, the type of toys that they stock in their store. Geppetto's refuses to stock any toys made of plastic or batteries in their store. That's how they fight the big boys in the win. And their goal is to spark the creativity that lies within a child. And finally, we have BeautifulPeople.com, the online dating site. Now, BeautifulPeople.com will refuse to grant you membership if you are deemed to be unattractive. Now, whether you agree or disagree with the positions that these companies have chosen for themselves, uh, themselves one thing is certain, and that's the fact that they have created a powerful statement by choosing who and what to lose. So think about how you might do the same. I'm Tom Wainick from marketingbeyondadvertising.com. Have a great week.